Full Fun Finance. We are here in Hawaii. What city we are at, I cannot tell you because I am not going to butcher the name of the city. But I will butcher the name of the restaurant that we are at. And we are at Ku Anaya. So this is a burger joint, I guess you can call it. And we're about to dive right into it. Stay tuned. Let's go. So Full Fun Finance, we just got the traditional meal fries. Looks like a beach meal because the beach is right down the street. You'll see the footage of the beach when we get there. And a burger. It's a pretty huge burger too. They cut it in half for us. This is a tasty burger. You could literally probably share this with somebody because this is huge. So it's kind of like a build your own burger kind of spot. And so we got the burger. We asked for avocados. It has bacon in there, lettuce and tomatoes and mayo. I'm gonna give this burger like a four point off. <laughs> Even though we really built it, but the flavoring for the burger is real good. It's made real fresh. And we got some lemonade. So these are just like traditional beach foods, beach items that you could order when you're at the beach, which is right down the street. Food Fun Finance, stay tuned for the review. So Food Fun Finance, we are at your favorite part of the show, the review. So we're gonna go over the environment, customer service, food, and pricing. Environment, we're in Hawaii. We are in paradise. So that's five stars across the board. The, the actual restaurant environment, I would give it like a 4.0 because Brittany says a 3.5. Because they have in and outdoor seating, it's right on the main street. There's parking in the back, there's parking in the front. There's AC in here. I like it. It's a little beach vibe, you know. So environment, 4.0 for me, 3.5 for Brittany. Let's go. Customer service. I think the customer service was great. They really didn't like serve us service, but they took our order at the counter and then they called us when our food was ready. So it's kind of 50% self-serve, 50% customer service so I think they did really good I would say 3.5 for the customer service we agree ding, 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 ding. so on to the food so food from finance the rating for the food to me was a 4.5 Brittany said a 4.0 I really actually based that off of the burger the burger was pretty good oh the, the fries Brittany said it was refried fries I don't even know how that makes sense, <laughs> but it's refried fries. She says she gave the fries a three, a two actually, two on the fries. They weren't that bad. So purchase at your own discretion. I give the fries a 3.5. And then we seen on Yelp that this restaurant was a 4.0. So that was pretty right. That was pretty accurate. So we agree with Yelp on that one, but there's plenty others that we didn't agree with on different reviews in different places, but you know, it is what it is. So, full fun finance, let's dive into the pricing. The pricing. I didn't get a receipt. I don't know why I didn't get a receipt, but I didn't get a receipt, but it was $27. So we had one burger cut in half, which really filled both of us up, but we eat like all day long to film these videos. So you may want to order your own burger. The fries were pretty big. We ordered a large fry and we had one large drink and one medium drink. So that was pretty good, $27. I really like the price. I would say a 4.5 for the price, most definitely. I think what scaled them back was those fries. So overall for the whole restaurant experience, everything all wound up together, 4.0. Most definitely, four point stars, that's what they get. Please stay tuned because we are in Hawaii and we have plenty of videos that's coming up. You just got to be here for it. So let's go. So Food Fun Finance, do me a huge favor to keep this channel going, to keep this channel growing. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below and let me know anything that's on your mind so we can keep this community growing. Let's go.